some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Another day, another dollar. Daylight comes, I'm on the way. Another day, another dollar. Working my whole life away. Welcome back guys. This is another episode here of the Home Farm Week uh, Harvest, right? We've done this a few times and these are usually a very successful episode. <laughs> um, anyways guys, we're going to make this year shorter. Um, just because. So I imagine the next time uh, you guys come and see me here, we're going to be probably have the old combine going as you can see behind me she's sitting there she's ready to go um, I think today is almost August 1st if not August 1st or 2nd but anyways we're we probably could have been going earlier but we just have things to do chicken barn stuff that stuff so uh, anyways guys I gotta walk all the way down over there to the new barn because my truck's sitting there um, We'll see ya. So, I said, oh, we'll be in the field. But no, we're not in the field. I'm here getting her all greased up. Um, get oil to change yet. But that's all I got left to do. And we're ready to go. Now, today is August the 2nd. Um, they're saying that we could be bailing tomorrow. I'm going to do some bailing for... Uh, our own stuff, but not our combine stuff. Our combine's not going yet. I'm going to do someone else's stuff, but our bales. So I'm gonna go bail them out, and then we'll go get them probably a week from now, because let them sit there in the field. Don't want them catching fire in our barn. They can catch on fire in the field if they're gonna catch on fire. <laughs> so anyways, that's, that's what's going on. Um, I'm still thinking we're gonna be at least another week off combining. Because we still got lots of chicken burns and stuff to do. All kinds of chicken burns. Um, alright. Alright guys, we made it. It is August 3rd. And that's Clay Hansom's and them over there with the combine doing the grain. And I'm going to bail up 100 bales here with our baler. Get everything geared. Ready to rock. Here we go. Well guys. I fired the drone up. Uh, I didn't know. Oh, look. There you go. There he is. See him? Oh. <laughs> Little green frog. Oh, there he goes. Anyway, <laughs> I fired the drone up. It was just too irresistible to resist. Uh, the guys are all gone. They're down across there to another field. I'm, uh, I'm about 40 bales away or so. I'm only getting 100. The old thing looked good. Alright. It's Friday. We're here. Uh, I think they finished the field combine sitting over there. Tides out. Uh, I'm gonna blow this off, grease it, and all that stuff. I got the leaf blower and all that stuff. Gonna clean her all up, and then we're gonna fire her up and go. Uh, I like to start out fresh every day, so I know there shouldn't be any hiccups. And if there is, well, there is. Here we go. Alright, guys. What time of day has it got here? Ah, it's 5 o'clock. Yeah, there it is. 5.11 in the morning sunday morning we're gonna go and we're gonna put some bales together pod them up get them ready to haul it's supposed to rain this week so if we don't do it now uh we might not have enough time to get it before it rains so if i get them all done up and everything it'll be way easier to load them and everything else so early bird gets the worm right Sunday morning. All right, guys. We got like ten coyotes here. 
That little black dot going right there is a coyote. <laughs> Not very good for you guys. And there's another one right behind it, right there. And another coyote. Two coyotes. But there's another three or four that went off over into the corn here. They must have been out here looking for uh, mice under the bales and stuff. But there's a few of them around. I'm going to go scare the hell out of them. I'm going to jump out of the tractor and go... <laughs> it's going to be funny. <laughs> They're going to run like hell. There Monday, Tuesday night next week. She said, yeah, we should have a big all-night togo party with the full moon out. Sounds like a great idea. I love Cameron Diaz. That, by the way, also was not hair gel on Beach Creep's earlobe. <laughs> BJ and the Q Morning Crew, weekdays 5.30 till 10 on the Mighty Q. Beef is back at Swiss Chalet. Enjoy our six-ounce Canadian AAA roast beef dinner. Friggin' old coyotes. i tell you one thing, if I had a gun, he'd have a bullet through him. <laughs> Ruination of the world right there next to... Mosquitoes and black flies. Oh, and I forgot the liberal government on that. The liberals. <laughs> Gotta get rid of those guys. Alright guys. This is the first time I've ever seen anything like this. If I can get it before he moves. Where is he? There he is. Here we go. Look where he is. Up there just laying on top of the veil. That's a coyote. More, they've been around, they're all over the place back here. Anyways, I'm at this field. <laughs> but yeah, that's crazy. I've never seen anything like that before in my life. <laughs> Maybe you guys have. I thought, actually, when I rolled in, I thought that was a mountain lion. <laughs> when, the, when I was just first looking at it, I thought it was a mountain lion at first. And I was like, that's going to be a mountain lion. But no, it's just a coyote. What's going on guys? We are back here again. Had a big long line of bales. There's more over there, more over there, more way down there. Um, had one extra one as you can see that one just barely sticking out. Um, today is Monday, Naval Day. It's Naval Day. And we're working. We chopped straw this morning in my barn, the four decker. And this afternoon we gotta haul straw because it's supposed to rain all week. So we gotta get these in and under cover. So we got this field, the other one over there by the cornfield, down by the, more by the road, and then there's another field over in here. I think I might use the drone though over in that field as we're loading bales. We'll see, we'll see if the weather pans out. It's a little dark there, some clouds are looking threatening, the spit and sputter. But, we'll see what happens. That little dotted line right there. Another coyote. Doo, doo, doo. He's heading this way. Sort of. He's kind of a prettier one. Kind of got a, like a German shepherd head. Pretty as they come. For their pelts. <laughs> Uh, no good coyotes, but they're, they're a nice animal, but they're not a nice animal. He's hunting mice. They're not good when they're getting school children and stuff like that. It's a great creature because of one thing, but when they start getting in towns and stuff like that, they start to get overpopulated. You're right up there at the end of those bales. Looking for some mice. Well, guys, we are down to the last bit. We got like 14 or something over here, 20 here. So, two loads left. Sitting here, enjoying a nice cigarette in the straw field. Uh, I'll make sure I put it out right. But it's nice and quiet. Did 
Yes, like that, guys. We're sitting at 13%. I measured it the first time. It's actually 12.9. I'm going to measure it again. But I think it's going to come out right around that 13% mark again. It is looking good. It is hot out today. Sitting here shelling this out on the back of this truck. It was hot. Wind is blowing. And that stuff is tall. You go over right in here and it's right up to your breast. Good tall scrawl. And that's what it looks like after. It has this little compression thing and it screws down a lot. And that's what it looks like after it compresses it all down onto the sensor that's inside of it. Now I leave quite a bit of trash on because if you just shell it down to the grain it's going to lie to you. You're going to pick up a certain amount of moisture going through the combine with the straw and everything. So if you put the straw in the tester and everything, that'll give you a truer tester or a true test. So uh, just a little hint there. <laughs> Our usual occurrence. <laughs> Combine's going guys. We got a few strips around her. Got trailer almost loaded. Baler's here. I'm gonna start her up here momentarily and start slapping some bales together. Come on guys. Turn that down here. Ah, kite right there in front of just that little black dot going in front of the track. Coyotes everywhere. <laughs> Seems to be the theme of this episode. Coyote and Roadrunner. He could be the Roadrunner, I'm the Coyote. Or maybe he's Coyote and I'm the Roadrunner. Eh. I shipped chickens last night, so I've been out for like a long time. <laughs> Let's just say. If I was a truck driver right now, they'd probably throw the whole book at me. <laughs> we are at store. We got coffees here this morning. Sun is just coming up over the clouds there. Uh, looks like it's going to be sunny. Looks like we're going to have to. We had a chicken barn to clean out this morning. Two chicken birds to clean out this morning. And then maybe we might be able to go combining. We'll see what happens though. Weather changes around here, like the tides. Alright guys. Um we got the chicken barns cleaned out and everything. Um, got that field I've been over there bailing. I'm gonna try to get the drone up and I just realized my back window's open. Uh get the drone up and then I start bailing here. Because the combine's over there. This is probably going to be my last chance because we got weather pushing in on us. And really, I don't have time to be dicking. <laughs> but uh, I'm at a wrap. We're at a wrap here. Hold on here. Oh, don't think. Hold the wrong thingy. There we go. Yeah, that's what she looks like when she's at a wrap. Right. So I got to put a new roll in and we'll be good to go. So here we go. Well guys, there she sits. Convoy's going. Baylor's down there. Baylor's broken. Actuator went on it. Uh, there's a metal rod on this electric motor. Anyways, the, the, the metal rod came out of the, the electric motor and like tore right out of it. And anyways, <laughs> I'm down and out and they can't send anyone. The person they're sending or anyone close. The person they're sending is coming from Windsor and that's about 40 minutes away so I'm gonna get something to eat. <laughs> well guys, everyone's over there. We are all stopped because I broke down with the baler. Right now I'm running her manually. <laughs> so I basically gotta hit extend and retract. It'll tell me when the bale's done. 
See my actuator's blake in there. Something wrong with that. Hey Case here, or title tractor. And they got me going to the point because I actually broke uh, electric motor, split that. Got lucky I had a spare. There we go. <laughs> Yep, she's all manually right now. <laughs> I don't think we're finishing tonight. I think the boys are all calling her quits. Away she goes, I guess. Ah, still going. Phone making it look brighter than what it really is. I got my lights on. Ah, oh, it's nice. Nice to be out here by myself when everything's kind of working right. We're almost there. There's the graphs. Remember to check out Apple Feather Farms episode if you haven't. Me and Vanessa. Uh, it's a good episode. Uh, right now, we're bailing straw. Oh. So. Uh, hopefully I get this episode out quick enough. Hopefully you guys enjoy it, like it, and all that crap. There we go. All right. I forget what today's date is. But there's Brent. He's going to Lynnhurst to uh, get some seed clean and treat it. And all that stuff so they're, they're heading off right now to do that and I got some bales to go put pod together and we still got combining to do and more baling to do so still lots going on it is Tuesday guys August I don't know, 16th 20th I don't know I've lost track of my days um, all the bales are going across there there's a second row there. Starting my next one. Uh, per apparently there's a hurricane coming. Or it could be coming. But uh, I got a fantastic shot with that nice cloud in the background. All the gear. I'm going to pop that up on the page. But I need to get back to work. Gotta stop dicking. We got bales going today. Thursday, tomorrow's Friday, it's supposed to rain all weekend. We even got a little 40 pulling bales. We're done, guys, just like that. We're in the new straw barn. French put the straw bales away. That's it. We're gonna have a party here soon. Gonna do the big thank you and all that here in a second. Here we go. Well guys, it's absolutely raining outside. It is Saturday, about 10 o'clock or so. Um, I'm doing the video up now as I'm talking. Um, I actually gotta do this video because I forgot to. So um, thanks for watching. Thanks for liking, sharing, subscribing. Thanks for everyone for letting me do what I do and uh, getting this out there. Thank you. Um, have fun. Uh, this should be a good video. Run into the railroad track, run along with Captain Jack. Run into the peace, come back, run along with.